What is it, my friends? So if you haven't already heard, if you've been living in Iraq, Crazy Rich Asians is actually doing more than great than what we expected it to do. So the movie was projected to make about $24 million, which is pretty good. And it's actually made around $32 million. So pretty awesome news for Crazy Rich Asians and just for diversity being more um, like just showing that people want these like uh, castings and yeah, I mean, it, it's great. It's great all around. I already talked about the ending and what I think is coming. As I said in that ending explained video, however, is that this is a trilogy. And now according to a lot of people, now I didn't get a chance to sit through this uh, post credit scene and watch it because I didn't think there was going to be a post credit scene because when I went to go watch this movie, I didn't even know it was a book or a trilogy. And now I know it is. So, of course, now that I'm thinking about it, there should be a post credit scene. According to the post credit scene that many people saw, this is alluding to more of Astrid's um, storyline in this whole uh, story, which, as I said in that ending explained, I feel wasn't really developed as much in this movie. And it looked like there was development and then they cut scenes from it. So that's why I felt a little staggered when it came to her. And yeah, my that's true there was now there's confirmation that there were other scenes that were filmed with her and this new mystery man that we see at the end of the movie in the post credit scene and apparently this mystery man will have a lot more impact in this upcoming sequel and of course in the third part as well so i'm wondering exactly how much of it will be astrid's story next and if it's just gonna like three different aspects of the family or is it going to go back and be centered around Rachel again I'm, I'm pretty curious about that but according to people who did see this um, in the novel there is a man named Charlie and this is who we see in the post credit scene that Astrid falls head over heels for and apparently they had been um, engaged at a point before but their families had a big dispute and everything that's caused them to be separated now the problem that comes into all of this is that Charlie is now married and then remember that we found out that Astrid's husband was actually having an affair well it turns out he wasn't he was just making this up so he could get out of the marriage and as we know he's felt pretty weird about Astrid having a lot of money and he himself not having as much money so that's one of the big things that's going to be coming into the upcoming movies and I can really see this love triangle being the center part of part two and I think that would be a really unique way to put this is have Astrid be the forefront of the second movie and then we still see Rachel and everybody but they're more of like background characters or secondary characters whatever you want to call it so yeah pretty much this is just setting up the sequel for the rich girl problems i think that's the name of the second book and i think that's going to be an interesting book so i'm pretty excited to check that out uh once it does come out but apparently he has already been cast and they already shot scenes with him so i'm pretty sure they're looking to make the sequel and the movie has been highly praised and getting uh accolades left and right for many uh, different, especially with the box office doing pretty good and being number one spot. So I'm excited to see what comes next. What do you think, however? Did you stick around for the post credit scene? Did you even think there was one? I mean, if it's not a Marvel movie, I'm not sticking around. And I didn't bother to look at like online. I usually do that with movies if I'm not sure. But the thing was that this was a screening. We couldn't have our phones on. So I just like had my phone off. So it, I didn't even bother. But anyways, let me know your thoughts below about what you think about this post credit scene. Are you excited for the sequel or not? Make sure you subscribe for more stuff you love about movies, music, and games. And as always, follow me on Twitter, Anchor, Twitch, all that good stuff. Links will be provided below. I'll see you all next time. Stay positive.